Hey yo everyone, it's your boy Rugby League Roundup back here with another video and today we get in uh, to a different type of video that we don't really do on the channel but it's a signing news video so um, before we get into the video I would like to give a few shout outs and you know um, Sam Revel, National Sports Loader, Nick from Australia, and uh, Proenzo Vids, um, CJ Moxley. I got a new subscriber. I think it was F1 Levin, Lemon. Yeah, I'm sorry if I got that wrong. Uh, so thanks for subscribing to the channel. Um, CJ Moxley, Rule Out Champa, and Rugby League History. Entertain house and yeah so i hope you guys make sure you guys like the video um and now we'll get into the signing so yes um it will it has not been confirmed yet but it has been reported that it will become official that josh hodgson will sign with the Parramatta eels for the 2023 season on a two-year deal, which will go to the end of 2024. Um, well, first of all, my thoughts on this signing. I think, you know, for because the Eagles lost free money, they went and got out a replacement. I just, I don't know this about this signing. I, I think it's a decent signing, but he's just, you know, it's just, he's too old now and he he'd be 34 by the time he joins um the club um so it's it's just gonna be uh just, he's gonna be just a bit old he'll be 35 by the end of the contract that's old so if if they were looking at a long-term replacement i would have gone for sam verrill's you know sam verrill's a perfect replacement He's young, he's fast, he's a good hooker, uh, dummy half, you know, um, very creative. He won a premiership and he was like 10 games into his career and he won them a premiership. How good is that? So, uh, surprised I didn't go for Sam Rebels now considering... Now, Brandon Smith is at the club, and you know Sam Verrills may have to face the fact that he will not be the starting hooker. And you know, I just think he deserves to be a starting dummy half, especially because he's a Premiership winner. So, uh, if they signed him in the long term, I wouldn't have minded that sign. But this signing, I'm not too sure about. I, I think it's a decent signing, you know, because he brings. You know, he was one of the best hookers in the game two years ago in 2020. Well, that was last year. That was basically last year. Um, but this year, he was shocking. So, uh, if he can fix his form for 2022 and, you know, go into the Eels with confidence and, you know, bring confidence in that club, then who knows? Maybe it could be good. You know, it's kind of like the Andrew McCulloch signing. I didn't mind it. I don't think he'd be the best, but he might. You know, he was one of the best players for the Dragons this year. So who knows? Josh Hodgson may be a big part of Parramatta. And, you know, they got a good spy in Parramatta. You look at it this way, you say, oh, well, they've got Gufferson, Moses, Brown, Dylan Brown, um, and Hodgson, and the third team is Nathan Brown. So that that's pretty decent, you know. Um yeah, but I just don't know how it could go. I think it's an all right signing. And, yeah, all the best at Parramatta, Josh Hodgson. Obviously, he had a bit of unrest at Canberra. So, yeah, what I rate out this signing out of 10 is a 5.5, uh, probably a 5.5, mainly because of things I just said. He's like he brings good experience. Um, defense isn't bad. Attack hasn't been right for the last couple of years. Uh, for the last year, for this year, he wasn't the best, but 2020 wasn't bad, uh, and especially 2019. But, geez, he was bad this year, so fixing that up, you know, he may be one one good hooker or good dummy half for the Parramatta Eels. 
All right, guys, that'll do it for this uh, video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, subscribe, and um, if if you're new to this channel, yeah, just subscribe. I'm also have a goal, uh, and that's in 14 days. I've got a 14 day goal, so you guys got two weeks for this. Um, I'm just asking to get to 30 by the end of two weeks. So in 14 days, if I have 30 subscribers, I'll be very happy. So if guys, shout, shout out, tell anyone you know or anyone that loves rugby league that this channel loves his rugby, this person loves his rugby league and made a channel about it and got really good content, you know, that, that, that'd be a real... Uh, supporting factor and i really appreciate that so guys i hope you enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe and like and we'll see you in the next one it's been your boy rugby league round peace